Hi, welcome to the second game in my series on games from the Indie Game in a Week 2 contest. Um, this week's game is the fourth place winner, which is, well, there was only five places, so this is the second to worst one. But it already looks a lot better than the one before, even though it's like default title screen music. It's called My Awkward Adventure in a Distant Land. It got 12 out of 70. Probably still bad, but the title's more interesting, and I didn't have to do anything for the game to actually work, so I have hopes for this one not being the worst game ever made. Since I'm pretty recently, this is what I can came up with. Sorry if it sucks XD. Oh my god, it's not finished! And the developer's talking to us! The story portion I invented are basically still non-existent? What, really? So there's no story? Uh... Uh... You can instantly recruit party members by going to these places. Okay, whatever. <laughs> and you could also mine for things by clicking on... Uh, the I don't care. The okay, so... What? What is this? Oh, a counter. This is default music. It's default music! Let's attack. Wait, this is supposed to be the rare enemy, right? Well, we found the rare enemy. Can we actually beat it? With like... This is the first enemy we're fighting. Uh, okay, I don't think we could beat this guy. We tried to escape, but it was unable to escape. Really? Are we gonna die? Hey, I'm doing my best to kill this guy. Oh, we have fallen. Game over. Wow, that was fast. Thanks for watching. No, just kidding. We'll, we'll give it another try. Maybe we won't run into a random way too hard encounter immediately. Alright, let's go. So let's go in. Oh, I mined some stuff. Great. Can't go to the village? Oh, hi there! Some person joined our party, and some other person joined our party too! Okay, this time it's enemies that we could probably beat. I'm just gonna do the thing I do in most RPGs and just spam A. Hey, look, it worked. Congrats. We found things. Can we not actually go into town? Uh, let's try going to this town. I'll join. That girl gives me flashbacks. Huh? Okay, suddenly we have a bunch of party members. Hi there, pal! Yeah, 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 yeah guys! Tsukuyomi. Isn't there something like that in Naruto? It's the infinite Tsukuyomi. I don't remember if that was what it was. Huh? Okay. More slimes. I wasn't surprised by the slimes, by the way. I'm just surprised by the fact that it looks like there's nothing to do in this game. Okay. Are you... Serious? I don't think we can actually go anywhere. How is this game rated better than the other game? Like, I know the other game had the worst grammar ever in this game. Well, it doesn't have the worst grammar ever, but you can't do anything in this game except fight slimes. Like, at least the other one had dialogue. Like, if that other game was rated negative 5, this game should be rated like negative 50. Why did you even submit this? Unless I'm, like, totally missing something. Like, all you can do is fight. This video is gonna be, like, five minutes long. Well, they did mention that they had another game. <laughs> Maybe I'll try that one if it's not super long, since this isn't enough to fill a whole video. But yeah, in my opinion, this game should be rated, like, negative 500. Okay, after about ten minutes of searching through all of the user's posts, I found this game that was made by the same person who made that horrible thing we just played. 
It's called I Demand Clarity, and they made this for the first indie game in a week contest. Uh, the one we're doing right now is the second. But this was for the first one, and apparently it has 30 minutes of content, but we probably won't see it all. Let's just, um, play it. Question time! Do you want to play as a boy or girl? Oh god, flashbacks to that other indie game in a week game. We'll be a girl though. Next question, which is your most favorite? This already has more gameplay than their newest game. Kinda sad. Whoops, I didn't even read what we picked. Well, that's annoying. Could there be more than just safe dream travel? You'll see for yourself. Welcome to your room. You can do some things in here. You can check the stuff on the table, cupboards and such. You can also change your wardrobe. Okay. And reality can be boring. Check your bed and you can do lucid dreaming. Oh, that sounds interesting. I hope, uh, I, I hope you'll enjoy your life, so I'll pass the narrative into your point of view. Look, this one actually has furniture! Okay, can I pick it up? No. No, an expensive piano. There's an older pipe organ somewhere in the basement. My little sis cooking. It's actually a pain to eat it. But she pour- Oh, that's funny. She poured all her spirit into these beer bottles. Anyway, I don't think that was intentional, but it was funny. Cooking books. Encyclopedia. Shoujo. Manga. <laughs> Paperworks. What? For what? Alright, I don't know what that means. Is this a door or is it just a missing shadow? No, it is a door. Alright. This is where I worship Hilda, the most beautiful paladin. What do you mean by that? Who is that? Let's see if we can learn more. Portrait of Goddess Hilda, stared at forever by like lucid dreaming war. Wait, is this the bed we're supposed to sleep in? Also, there's a chest here that's already open. Whoops! Well, now that we're looking at this, why did they put this part on the right? I guess it looks cool. So we're a lucid dreamer. Oh, okay, this has a different XP system than most RPG Maker games. They probably just used the script, <laughs> if we're being honest here. So is this the bed we can sleep in? Wait, I want to check the other bed first. And maybe that door that's over there? Okay, the other bed is literally nothing. And the door... Uh, oh, this is the door to go outside. Okay. Well, I guess we can't, so we're going to begin lucid dreaming session. Please select one of these things. I'm gonna pick a manor, so we don't forget which one we picked first, if we have to pick them all. This is one of my dream worlds. I can explore here and see what happens. Although it would be nice to meet dream characters. Some might even decide to tag along with me, who knows. I'll need to be careful with some of them, though. I should equip my weapon and stuff. I should. Skill. No, it's gears, probably. Oh, we have Dream Blue. I wish this stuff was just equipped by default. Okay, that's all we have. Oh, we should just click this. Oh, maybe we should also save the game. Uh, can you can you save the game in this game? Oh, I don't want to read. I just want to save. You can't save? Well, that's weird. Okay, let's enter the manor. Not bad. I should look for a safe room now, since I don't want to wake up yet. I see, so you have to save... in... Like, you have to save at in-game save points, it seems like, and what was that pink thing just that just ran by us? Something falls from the ceiling! Oh god, what is it? It is Hanged Figure. Hmm. I don't know if these graphics are default or not, but if not, they look pretty good. I don't remember them, so... Okay, let's fight. So somehow we're fighting them with music. I would say that's weird, but if this is a dream, I guess it's not that weird. There, we did it. I I want to find a safe room. 
Is this a safe room? Well, we can't go that way because there's a wall. Oh, here's a room. Okay, the door. We can't get in there. Whoa. Oh, man, that's... This guy is strong. Escape! Really? Is it really gonna be this hard to escape? Um, we don't have a heal. Oh wait, we do. Okay. By 200 points, huh? Let's do it. Yes, evade. Okay, let's do skill. Wait, 10 HP? It takes HP to do this? Good thing we didn't use it before. Or does it take 10 HP from the... Well, that seemed like worse than an actual attack. How much health does this guy have? I think we're gonna die if we don't just run away. Okay, this is definitely not balanced. Oh, we did. Well, that was like impossible. Tuesday, huh? Oh yeah, I have a club meeting today. Oh, okay. So dying in game does not give you a game over, it seems. Well, it, it kind of- oh, yes it does, because you can't hit continue. It just doesn't have a weird game over thing. Oh, uh, let's try the boy this time. Okay, this time I will actually read the choices. Oh, last time I picked Lucid Dreamers, so we became Lucid Dreamers. Can we pick something else and it'll be different this time? Let's try the Reapers. So maybe now we just kill people instead of dreaming for a living. No, okay, we just happened to pick Lucid Dreaming last time. Why can't you save in this game? <laughs> it's so annoying. Okay, this time we're going to go to a different place. We'll go to a fantasy kingdom. Oh, we can't go there. Okay, let's go to a reason. Oh, we can't go there either. Okay, I guess we're going to a manor again. Okay, we already read this before. What is our weapon this time? Hopefully it's a better weapon, but it's probably the same weapon. No, it's different. It's a reaper gun, so you get different things based on what you picked. Hopefully this is a better weapon than the other one. And hopefully we don't like immediately run into some enemy we can't run from and is way too hard. Okay, maybe the harder enemies are up there. So we should try to go this way first. And maybe one of these will be the save room. This doesn't look like a save room. Are we following that girl? Well, I want to go to this room. That's not a room, that's a fireplace, I think. Okay, we got a key. Main chamber key. Alright, can't go in there. Okay, this guy's probably not as hard. It's Loner! The spamming of the A button. It's the best way to play these games. What is my skill anyway? Okay, it's... It's a like skill that uses luck to attack. Oh, really? I missed. Come on, I just want to get somewhere before I immediately have to fight an unfair encounter. Is it that room that's up there, maybe? Really? It's this guy again? Oh, we're screwed. This guy does way too much damage. Yep, those are all pointless. Like, bring back a defeated ally? Like, I don't think we'll be able to do that. Like, should I just keep spamming escape? Because there's no way we could beat this guy. Uh, not working. Okay, Ripper shot! That barely does more than our normal attack. Ah, we were defeated again. What are we going to say as we die this time? Saturday siesta. Hello? Hello? Well, that w I think we can all agree that was better than the other game they made, and it seemed like it could have actually been decent, except for it seemed really badly balanced. 
Um, maybe I'll try this again some other time, but for now, I don't really feel like playing it more. So, yeah. I would rate this one, like, uh, I don't know, like, 20 out of 70. <laughs> Just because you can't get past the first part and you can't save ever. But, hey, that's still better than negative 500 out of 70. So next time, we'll be playing the number 3 game in the contest. Bye!